The music here steals across the sea. It elevates all the littleness of feeling. It softens rock and it bends the iron one tree. It is the music of the swanky kitchen band. Is, right? Swanky is the Caymanian word for lemonade, right? So we either take a, a, a yellow lime, a local small key lime, or a Seville orange, we call it Seville orange. You take that, squeeze that into some water, mix it with some brown sugar, like pure Jamaica brown sugar, cane sugar, and it's the most refreshing drink on the face of the earth. This was the kitchen tool used for grating coconuts, cassava, all the hard stuff. That's, that's what we would use it for. Cheese was something we would cut with a knife, <laughs> not the grater. Yeah, kitchen band music is um, the traditional music of the Cayman Islands. Um, back in the day, our homes uh, were um, in the front and the kitchens were detached from the homes. So the kitchen was kind of like the focal point. There weren't really living rooms in a lot of the traditional houses. So the kitchen was kind of like the focal point of the family. So when they'd cook up their food in the kitchen, um, sometimes there'd be a reason for a celebration, whether a birthday or the men would come back from sea or there was, there was a holiday and farms would get together um, in the caboose, that's what we call the kitchen, the caboose, and um, they cook up food and they pull out instruments and start to have a little informal celebration. It wasn't really a formal dance, it was just a kitchen dance in the kitchen or in that area around there. seem to figure out that the influences um, reflect who we are as a people. Um, you have a, our people are, are, are um, trace our ancestry from the British Isles, like, you know, um, England, Scotland, Wales, Ireland, and so it has that strong um, Celtic influence with the fiddling and the kind of Irish jig music. Um, and I think that's kind of why the fiddle was the preferred instrument here. Many of us, all of us can trace some form of ancestry from that side, but obviously there's African ancestry as well through the slaves that were brought here. And um, the rhythm, as you can tell, is undeniably African. So the combination of the Celtic jig and fiddling music with the African rhythms is what has kind of morphed into what we have as kitchen band music.